I think so far so good. So far so good. And uh, because this is more like a, uh, a certificated retail, this is more like nom- nominally people used to see the uh, countdown on the PSLV or GSLV on the launch pad that day. And uh, it starts 36 hours, 48 hours or 24 hours, depending upon the mission configuration. But when the, uh, that means uh, uh, so many parameters uh, of the, uh, the launch vehicle, which is in front of you, you are through a computer reading and uh, various ground systems, after launch uh, radar system, ground systems, many things have to come on functional and those systems also along, along with the redundancy main and redundant systems main and redundant computers and uh, everyone should be ready and uh, even there also we'll be uplinking good amount of uh, programs such that how it will take a path okay if it's a polar orbit or a geosynchronous orbit or uh, the navigational satellites or the planetary mission is a different path so the the, the third are also could have been programmed so that program uplink would have happened there and then try to read whether uh, uh, the program uplinks are in a place and uh, that too has many of the parameters uh, like for example Luna 25 whatever happened uh, they, they doubt about a possibility of uh, uh, the firing uh, for the last leg the firing is happened uh, few seconds more than what they expected okay that translated into the mission failure so that basically uh, that means there is some memory something could have got disturbed so that could have probably probably could have uh, created a problem so such things should not happen for us and uh, so far that so we, we uh, we normally will keep uh, three memory locations uh, vital parameters so any one of them uh, all the three are normally supposed to be okay if any one of them gets upset single event upset something like that they will tell so then majority voting of the other two will do so similar like, like that many many intricacies are there in the onboard program so these things to be also to be after uplinking to be verified here but now the lander is uh, 3 lakh 84 thousand kilometer away so we uplinked all the commands there uh, not the launch vehicle just a few meters away from you so then that also you downlink and may make sure that every portion of the uh, program has been uh, uplinked correctly and until last minute everything is okay so the intactness of all the systems until you gave clue queue to go oh, should be verified i think that's the process going on now and so far so good and we expect uh, uh, the, as per the plan a uh, today we must be able to go a small update has happened because of the timing is concerned because of an updated orbit uh, other than that i think everything uh, remains same and the and like anybody else i am also eagerly waiting for that queue after discovery of water on the moon for Chandrayaan 1, the world world was trying to look the moon differently. Uh, that means concentrating, focusing on the polar region. So that way, uh, the some of the uh, follow-on missions confirmed whatever we have seen is uh, perfect. And now the variation is including uh, uh, USA, uh, Russia, uh, China, Japan, European countries are very, very ambitiously trying to do yeah, bigger missions. For example, Apollo is sup- supposed to be a bigger th- mission, uh, the spending and the energy point of view in those era. But now even beating Apollo Artemis is coming, uh, lunar resources coming uh, from Russia, uh, China also ambitiously plays. So like that, many things happen for that seed has happened by our Chandrayaan mission. So now taking ahead logically now whatever we have seen uh, in remote sensing point of view now we are going to land so that all time also yes we have discovered first uh, in the water on the moon uh, our chandrayaan is the first uh, similarly chandrayaan 3 is going to make history of the uh, first system to land softly land on the uh, lunar polar region uh, actually in fact uh, our presence already there in the south pole uh, with the uh, tricolor flag uh, with the where our along with the moon impact probe chandrayaan one itself made our presence but that time it was a impacted probe as planned uh, but now i think we are going to softly land and that will enable logical extension how what to do uh, in the uh, place something you have to do in a robotic mission something you have to put a man in the uh, uh, moon back so everything you calls for a soft landing so that that way the soft landing uh, will uh, help us uh, will enable us to be in the lead in the uh, back to the moon uh, campaigns are concerned so that way i think india will can keep it edge uh, technically uh, for the follow on missions